Gonambrasia balina is a species of moth, which is native to warmer parts of South Africa. His large edible caterpillar known as Medora worm or caterpillar or Amasimbi, it feeds mainly, but not exclusively on the caterpillars the leaves of the trees. The caterpillar worms are an important source of protein for millions of people in the region. These caterpillars are not restricted to the mopane tree, Colophosperma mopane, for their food source but can be found on quite a number of different species. It is due to the dominant nature of the mopane tree and the subsequent collection of vast numbers of caterpillars from these trees that the tree and this moth are usually only associated with each other. The insect offers a great potential source of protein that could be utilized to alleviate diet deficiencies diseases among most vulnerable groups in society. The insect could form a foundation for new food products that are based on its substantial nutritive value. Probably the best known of the edible caterpillars is Gonambrasia balina, the so-called Mopanea worm, which is widely eaten in southern Africa. The South African Bureau of Standards has estimated annual sales of Mopanea through agricultural cooperative markets at about 40,000 bags, each containing 40 kilograms of traditionally prepared, dried caterpillars. This total represents only those entering reported channels of commerce and does not include those privately collected and consumed or sold. The caterpillars, up to 10 centimeters in length, grip the host plant tightly and cannot be shaken off, they must be picked by hand. A good picker in an average infestation can collect 18 kilograms per hour. In areas where they are abundant and bulk dried, they are first eviscerated and then roasted for 15 minutes before being spread out to dry. About two days are required for the product to become dry enough for storage. The Mopanea caterpillar is an important food item and is actively traded not only in South Africa but also in Botswana and Zimbabwe and is exported by the ton to Zambia. From extensive studies in South Africa, Dreer and Wemeyer concluded in 1982 that the consumption of Mopanea caterpillars can to a substantial degree supplement the predominantly cereal diet with many of the protective nutrients. The amino acid composition of the dried caterpillars is relatively complete, with high proportions of lysine and tryptophan, which are limiting in maize protein, and of methionine, limiting in legume seed proteins. There is increasing concern in South Africa that the Mopanea caterpillar might be collected to the point of extinction. Dried Mopane worms can be eaten raw as a crisp snack, although in Botswana people tend not to eat the head. Alternatively, Mopane worms can be soaked to rehydrate, before frying until crunchy or cooking with onion, tomatoes and spices and serving with sadsa. The flesh is yellow and the gut may still contain fragments of dried leaf, which is not harmful to humans. The taste is somewhat reminiscent of tea leaves. As the dried mopane worm has very little flavor and is sometimes compared to eating dried wood, mopane worms are frequently canned slash packaged in tomato sauce or chili sauce to enhance the flavor. Traditionally, the caterpillar worms are harvested for food. Due to the seasonal nature of the occurrence of these edible caterpillars, they are not year-round power source. However, the traditional caterpillar harvesting the worm develops to be more commercially driven. Since 1950 IES, the methods of agricultural production were applied, the caterpillar harvest of the worm, especially in South Africa. Leave your comments below. Take care and be safe. Bye.